Hello everybody, my name is Grimscythe and welcome back to Stonehearth. Alright, so we are building that first longhouse that we're going to use to uh, give our hearthlings a place to sleep. And once we get that done, then we'll start working on individual houses to get them all set up. So they have uh, individual living spaces, because they're not going to like living in close quarters with others. Um, as in most games, they want their private space, um, unless they're, um, well, I think for the most part, that's just always the case, so, uh, we're gonna definitely make that happen for them. Uh, so what else can we work on in the meantime? We've probably got a good chunk of the stuff built we need for the house already. Um, yeah, it looks like it. We had, had them make us an extra farmer's hose so we can help somebody else help with the fields. Um, so let's see about that. Uh, first off, I need to get this thing to go get rid of that. We don't need that one. Okay, so who else is going to be our farmer? Question, let's see. So we got these four. You are... Eat anything and not picky at all. That's probably not a good person to be a cook. <laughs> Probably not. Animal Companion would be a good person for, uh, well, I don't know. Um, is there any of these other people that are going to be good for being a cook, necessarily? Featherweight walks faster, carry less as a result. I mean, that doesn't really matter. Maybe somebody that's mediocre, like, you are kind of mediocre. I don't really have anything high or low for stats, so we'll probably just make this person the, the farmer for now. <clears throat> They'll end up being the cook unless I find somebody better, I think. So for now, that will be our other farmer. And <clears throat> we haven't grown anything out here yet, but we should have some stuff coming in soon. Um, and then we need to find a way to... We're going to end up losing some of this food at some point because it's going to go bad just sitting out here. Um, I don't remember if there's some sort of food storage we can use later. Uh, but we don't currently have access to anything like that. Uh, Simple Merchant has arrived with wares to sell. Uh, okay, so what do you have that I may want? These outfits are always pretty nice. I don't really have any gold to speak of, though. Um, I could sell like some of those small boxes I know I'm not going to use. So let me get rid of those. It's not going to give me much money, but it is something to get rid of. Yeah, honestly, real, really, I'm not going to be able to get rid of anything else. But we'll see these merchants often enough that I don't have to worry about this too much. All right, daily update. Oh, yeah, our worth is high enough that we're actually going to get a new population. Um, we will take this one. Um, in the future, I may hold back until we get better living arrangements. But for now, Alex Baral has joined us. So where is he coming in at? Alex, where are you? Um, Let's see. What do you got going on for you? You are a passionate archer. Oh, nice. So we're going to have to get ourselves another footman here. Um, and then when we can, we'll make him into an archer. Um, actually, I want to look down at that. Let's see. Um, first. And here. So archer bow is going to require a carpenter level 4. So that's definitely a ways off. But we can get him into, into being a... <clears throat> Being a soldier for now, I think it's under the same tree, is it? Let me see. Um, if we go to... Let me see. Yeah, so we'll have to train as a footman before we can even become a bowman anyways, or archer. So we'll get that started uh, right now. So we'll go ahead and make us an extra wooden practice sword. And we need some more wood, because we are now out of wood. Um... So they probably don't have enough wood to even build that house right now. So we can snag up probably these ha these uh, trees over here. Let's see, gather those. Just all of those is fine. Is that a little rabbit over there? Hey, bunny. How are you doing? Don't you worry for now. I cannot... Oh, there's a bunny over there. Just hanging... Oh, that's our companion bunny, though. Companion bunny. These are starting to sprout a little bit. 
We're probably gonna need more boxes than what we have here too, because this is not gonna hold all the food we're gonna end up having um, at some point. Although it may hold a pretty good portion. I'll have to see. It's gonna be important that we get to cook in <clears throat> sooner than later so we can actually uh, actually make some prepared foods that'll make people happier. And we need to also figure out what that's going to take. So we'll need to get level two farmer. That's not really a big deal. But the thing is, is where do we make the tool for where do we make the, the ladle thing? We can make a mason hammer now. <clears throat> An herbalist staff would also be useful. We have invaders approaching. Um, did we get our other footman yet? I don't think she made our other our other practice sword yet because we're out of out of material. I think yeah, she fell asleep before finishing it. <laughs> well, we just got the one footman right now. So where where are they coming from? I missed it. Probably was supposed to click on it and I missed it. Wait, here we go. Um, shoot, where are they? Oh, they're over there. All right, our footman's already on it. This this should be fine. These guys aren't that tough. Hopefully. Fight, fight, fight! So these little guys are just little rock dudes that pop up once in a while. Um, the game will kind of escalate in difficulty over time. Um, so for now, we don't have much threats, but over time, we'll have to worry about a little bit more. There's Alex. Yeah, totally got this under control, though. I think uh, healing is a is a bit rough in this game. Um, until you have a healer, it takes a it seems like it takes a very long time to get the health back. But they often don't send invasions like that close together, so we should be okay. Should be okay. And then that guy dropped a uh, dropped a hunk of stone. <laughs> He's <t> <laughs> uh, so tired, just. Had to get up, fight, and go back to sleep. Everybody needs beds. <laughs> this house is coming together. We're getting there. Um, we still need to get them, get them, get us some more wood to finish this. Probably. It looks like they're taking down the scaffolding, so uh, they are probably done with most of it now. Yeah, I think actually we're in the fin finishing sta stages of this. Boy, I can't talk today. Um, and then we'll have to start making some beds and stuff. Um, so we're going to have to look at that. Can we do, like... We're going to need to get some cloth going. Not a comfy bed. I want, to, want cheap beds. That just takes wood. Uh, so, yeah, we need to get... We need people to get out there and get some wood for us. And I may end up putting in a couple more farms up here uh, in the future because it looks like they can easily manage what they have right now. I'll see what it looks like next round. It seems like they can handle more than one farm each, but I don't know. We'll see. Um, what are we waiting on here? Oh, nothing it looks like. Are they building the scaffolding up now? I thought they were building it down. Uh, okay, never mind. They're still doing the roof then. Oh, she's so excited. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, yeah, they're putting the roof on now, so uh, they still do got some work to do there. Uh, I think the carpenter's done with their jobs, though. And actually, let's get our other person on the footman job here. So, not you. Not you. Need to get Alex. Change jobs to footman. Bonk. All right. And we'll have two soldiers this time. Make it a little easier to defend next time. Um, and then everybody else can stick to what they're doing right now. Oh, holy wooden sword. There we go. Now they'll patrol together. Now we'll look for the bad guys. <clears throat> um, okay, so we're going to get that wood, which is what they need for the finishing of the house. And I'm going to need to get started on some of this furniture. Uh, let's see. So we need like eight beds. Uh, I don't know if we're going to have enough material for that, but we're going to queue it up. And hopefully we'll end up with enough eventually. Um, I could prioritize the tree chopping so everybody could be at work here. 
I think. I think there's a way to do that. Um, or maybe not. Suits. Seems like there is, but it's kind of obscure. Um, not that. Well, oh, maybe, no, that's just a bulletin. What is our, no notifications. Oh, that's okay. Uh, they'll figure it out. All right, so uh, I'll speed it up a little bit here because we're kind of just waiting on the next nightfall. They'll sit around the campfire and stuff. Uh, look at that camp standard. I would like to actually move that to kind of to the corner. Uh, right over there. It looks fine. Just gonna plop it over there. There we go. You guys sitting around the campfire. Soon. Soon! <laughs> Light up the fire. It's dark, people. Uh, she is healing up, so we'll be okay there. Um, getting an herbalist out here would also be useful. Um, but it also takes away from our building people, uh, which is kind of, it's kind of a tough call. Looks like we got yeah, we're getting mostly there. That's the roof coming in there. Almost done. Uh, okay, let's get this off of here. It looks weird looking at it like that. Uh, all right, let's figure out what else I need, because I need to start getting some other kinds of crafters uh, up here. Um, how far are we away from getting... Oh, we're going to need leather to make that bow, too, so... Next time I find a merchant, I want to see if I can buy some, because I'm not going to be able to make my own leather for a while. I would like to uh, get a mason as well. Craft requirements unmet. What? Are you just talking because I don't have enough wood? That's fine. Here. I'll get it eventually. <clears throat> Every time I see that heart, I think they, like, they're, they're in love or something. It's just their, their health. Alright, now we're taking the scaffolding down for real this time. So the house is almost done. Need to, uh... Oh, x-ray is what I need. No? No, that's not what I need. Slice down. No. Oh, I know. It's this one here. There we go. We can be able to see inside from when we're putting down these beds and stuff. Have we get any beds built at all yet? Um... Let's see. Place bed. Here we go. So... We're not really going to have any division of space in here to speak of. Because um, i got to fit eight beds in here, so it's going to be pretty tight. So, I, th I don't know if that can fit in one space or not. I'm going to try to see if we can make it work. Alright, there's another bed. Actually, that worked out perfect. Okay, so we got three, six beds. We may have to put two on the other side. At least people have a place to sleep. I mean, that's that's a start. All right, we got Rufus here selling uh, various ores and stone furniture, which we do not need right now. Um, in future, we'll probably start producing a bunch of things that we can just uh, and sell a few of these. A bunch of things we can just sell to make some money. Um, for now, that's fine. Just get a little bit of off of there. I don't want to get rid of all of our food. I need that. Looks like they're still harvesting carrots up. That's actually worth some pretty decent money. Yeah, everybody can sleep in beds now. Hooray! Let me get some lighting and stuff in the in the future as well. Get some torches around here. Just a wood block laying there. All right, did you finish up uh, all the beds? Not yet. Okay, you got two beds left to make, and then the mason's hammer and chisel. We'll also need to set ourselves up in the mine um, as well. <clears throat> Everybody's sitting around eating right now. We'll also in the future need to get ourselves like a dining hall. Not enough food, not enough worth. That's fine. Wasn't ready for another person yet anyways. Why is our bed just sitting there? The heck? Um, okay. Let's see, let's turn that around, shall we? Yeah, that's too tight to do there, so let's go ahead and just kind of put it up against the wall like this. We could just do it. Yeah, let's just do it down here. Right there. Looks like somebody maybe had tried to put... What's up with that? Can you not reach the bed? Why is that arrow there? Oh, weird. I don't know what that arrow is about. 
Oh, am I targeting that? No? I don't know. That's weird. Okay, so we got one more bed to put down for the eighth person. Got the bed face in the same way. Is that two spaces? Yeah, it looks fine. Probably don't even need the spaces, really, because nobody's going to be at the foot of the bed there. Alright, so not ideal living situation for people being happy about their space, but at least they'll have a place to sleep at night for now. Kind of like a barracks. Bunkhouse, I don't know what you want to call it, but that's where they're sleeping. Uh, okay, it looks like we're making the mason, a mason tool now. <clears throat> Alright, so I want to start designing the first actual house here. Um, so, or should I do something else first? I might, might try to work on expanding out our ability to keep more people, because the construction is going to take a lot of time and people that we frankly will need more of. Um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to double our farmland and see how they handle that, and we'll get more variety of food as well. Um, so in the meantime, I'm going to make like six more boxes. Uh, that way we can fit in more here. So let's go ahead and place down some more farms. Go there. And there. And we have other options now for growing. Which we're going to need. We're going to need like silkweed to make thread that's going to be important um we could also let's see we don't have pumpkins yet either we also need healing herbs so you know what we're going to do actually i take that back what i'm going to do for now is i'm going to just do two more food and then we'll do more um other types later here so let's get a pumpkin since we don't have that yet did i not click that that was weird and then this one, oh, that one's also a pumpkin. I don't know about two pumpkins. Um, maybe an X separate, a second carrot probably be fine. There we go. Um, then we also want to put down the road. Let's see. Design building. Roads. And this was the, was it the lemon ginger? Yeah, I think it was. Okay, so we'll put this in here. Kind of finish out the roads there. Go, finish, uh, build, yes, build. Takes a little bit of wood, not too much. Everybody get out there. Is that guy a mopey? Are you looking mopey? Yeah, he's sad. He's glum. Stuff hasn't been turning out as he would like. Oh. Poor guy. Um, we can also designate different jobs over here, which can be pretty helpful. Uh, I'm not going to worry about that much right now. Uh, do we have any boxes yet now? Uh, looks like we've got four of them. Okay, let's go ahead and start getting these into place then. So we'll put those two over there. Carpenter level three! One step closer to be able to make our archery bow, which is nice. And what can we do with three? Uh, let's see. Three... I don't think we got a we can get a rough wooden shield that allows us to make a knight later uh, which would be nice um I think, what level do you need to be to make a knight i gotta remember now in a little bit uh let's take a look at you so knight we would need to have a level three footman and a shield so i don't think we have that going on even remotely close uh autumn what level are you you're not even level two yet they're going to get a little bit of XP just from patrolling, but most of it's going to come from the combat. Autumn's pessimistic. Huh. That's okay. So, okay, they're growing that next crop. That's fine. Looks like the crops are a little bit weird right now. What are you doing? Sneezing? What was happening there? Uh-oh. Vega's approaching. Oh, there they are. Let's go ahead and just... Uh, <clears throat> get our combat party... Attack move. Go. I didn't really need to do that because they're already on it, but I wanted to do it just for the heck of it. Little tree guys. You guys are pretty weak. 
Just the same things like as the little rock guys, only this time the tree guys. Take them down. Get some wood out of them. A question, question. <laughs> did we get our masonry hammer? We did. Okay, I'm going to make somebody a mason. Uh, we need to start playing around with some stone, get somebody leveled. Yay, experience. Level up. He's like, hey, thanks for the wood. <laughs> there you go. Okay, who's going to be our uh, mason? Got three people left. You're callous. Slow. Go eat anything. Not really helpful. Charismatic. And jokester. Neil is just featherweight. I don't, I don't really know. I guess... I guess Irving. I don't know. There you go. Boom. You to Mason. You to Mason. Once we get that, we'll put down a workstation for the Mason. Uh, this will allow us to get the food we need for the... <clears throat> for our next hearthling to join us. Uh, so that's why we're building out this. We still have room for a couple more beds in here. Why is that... Did that move the bed? Weird. Um, okay. That's what was happening. I was moving the bed instead of... Well, my mistake. So let's get this actually in there properly this time and leave it there. Also, let's put this down. Pretty eaten. I still feel bad these guys don't have a table to eat at. Better fix that soon. I could just make an outdoor dining area. That would be better than nothing, I suppose. What about that? Um, probably need more wood, of course, but, uh... Wouldn't be too bad. I mean, we just need to get some, like, some, like, dining tables. How many people can we sit? I think we can actually get four at a dining table. We only need two of those, and then we need, like, a bunch of chairs. 20% more satisfying. It's probably worth going for the, the cathedral chairs. Oh, no, that doesn't make any difference. Except it impresses your neighbors. Uh, let's just go with the cheap chairs. We need eight of those. Whoop, not 58. That's definitely not what I want. There we go. <laughs> Whoa, no, not, no. Not that many ch chairs. That would be a lot of chairs. Um, <clears throat> okay, so. Carpenter's got a lot of work ahead there. Probably not enough wood there in the pile. Um, little raccoon. I need to get some more harvesting of wood out here. So let's go ahead and snag up these trees over here. Maybe we'll grab a couple more here. We're going to need to get a tree farm um, in the future as well. But there's a lot of trees out here. I mean, obviously, it's a forest. Uh, but it will be nice to, to, to grow some trees and then be able to reach them at a much shorter distance in the future. Okay, so I think that is all the time I have for in this episode today. And we'll continue on in the next episode. Thank you everybody for watching. I really do appreciate it. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.